Hello, hello, I'm Laura. I'm a Canva creator and I'm going to be showing you some amazing shortcuts that you can use with presentations. So if you use presentations within your business or, you know, day to day life, they're fantastic in Canva and they are brilliant to create and easy and simple. But there are some really fun features Canva have added that you may not have noticed. So I'm going to go over to share my screen and I'm just going to show you a Canva template and I'm going to show you what these features are. OK, so this is just a bog standard. Um, amazing Canva template that I have just added into a presentation. So go to presentation as a template, open up a template size, create your presentation. And upon presenting it, you can record it as well. Uh, recording presentations in Canva is brilliant. But upon presenting it, you can use some great short shortcuts to just give it that little extra something. So I'm going to show you how to do this. We've got the present button here. Um, you've got different types of presenting. So you've got presenter view. You can present and record yourself as you present. You've just got the standard, which will just go through the presentation. Um, that's the one I'm going to use today. OK, so I've selected standard. I'm going to hit present. And here we go. We are on our presentation. So, um, for example, the I've got a list of them here because there's quite a few. I'm going to show you what these do. OK, so first of all, the Q button on your keyboard. These are all keyboard related. If you press the Q button on a particular page, you will have this awesome little shushy guy up here. Press the Q button again and it takes him away. OK, so the next one you have um, something you want to show people and you think to yourself what can I do to build up a bit of excitement you can press the D key press the D key again and it goes down and then you can tell people what your amazing offer is um, oh the next one I'm going to go through a couple of pages just show you on different pages is the B key. So for example, you want to blur something out. So you don't want people to see it because you want to, you know, hit the drum roll key at the same time and then you can bring the blur back again. So B is a blur key. Um, oh, I love this one, C, hit the C key. And you get this amazing celebration. You get these little colors flicking across the page. I think that's a wonderful one. They come up from different areas depending on pressing I'm pressing the C key over and over again and they're coming out from different sections um the U key is the next one I'm going to show you it drops the curtains so you've got a big reveal you want to show someone you want to say, talk about a new course or something or a new product or something you want to reveal you can press the U key to close the curtains press the U key again and they open and you can reveal whatever it is you're revealing. Um, the next one, I'm gonna to go to a different page and we are gonna hit the M key. This is a mic drop moment. We are dropping that mic. We are on the last page. We're going, this is an amazing presentation. I've just given you all of my knowledge. I'm dropping the mic, mic drop moment. I love that one. Um, and lastly, one of my favorites, I think this is really sweet, is the O key. Press O and we have bubbles. I mean, who doesn't love bubbles? I think they're brilliant. You have all these bubbles coming up from the bottom of your screen throughout your presentation. I don't know how you would use that, but I think it just looks awesome. So there you go. Q, D, O, B, C, U and M. They all are different magic shortcuts within Canva when you are on your presentation mode. So what do we think? I think they're fantastic. I love the bubbles, which is O. So I'll just run through them quickly again. Q is shush. D for drum roll. O for bubbles. B for a blur. C for the celebration colors that you get. Um, M for the mic drop and you for the curtain closures and opening. 
I love them. I think it's going to make presentations so much more fun in Canva. That's it from me today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to um, press the follow button for all my future videos.